Good evening, everyone. I'd uh, like to call to order a uh, public hearing for Monday, December 19th, 630. Um, there, this is for um, bylaw number 1655, cited as Colwood Land Use Bylaw number 151, 1989, Amendment number 156 for Comprehensive Development CD 22 Zone Area 4. Bylaw number 1655-2016. Um, they're looking for approval of our agenda. Moved. All those in favor? Opposed, motion carried. Uh, I'll read the following statement in opening the public hearing. This public hearing is convened pursuant to section 890 of the Local Government Act to allow the public to make representations to council respecting matters contained in the following proposed bylaw. Colwood Land Use Bylaw number 151-1989, Amendment number 156, Comprehensive Development, CD 22, Zone Area 4, Bylaw number 1655-2016. Every one of you present who believes that your interest in this property affected by the proposed bylaw shall be given a reasonable opportunity to be heard or to present written submissions respecting matters contained in the proposed bylaw. None of you will be discouraged or prevented from making your views known. However, it is important that you restrict your remarks to matters contained in the proposed bylaw. When speaking, please commence your remarks by clearly stating your name and address. The function of counsel at this public hearing is to listen rather than to, to debate the merits of the proposed bylaw. After the public hearing has concluded, counsel may, without further notice, give whatever effect counsel believes proper to the representations made at this hearing. Please re be reminded that after the hearing, there is no further opportunity to speak to counsel. Your opportunity is now. With that, um, I'm looking to staff for an introduction. Mr. Borhill. Thank you, Your Worship. I'd like to start off by clarifying that the changes proposed to the CD22 zone only apply to the area identified as sub area four within that zone, which lie adjacent to Delora Drive. Furthermore, it has come to the attention of staff that bylaw number 1655 as currently proposed does not include a maximum number of the dwellings in area four that would be permitted to be detached. This is despite a council resolution made at their regular meeting uh, held on September 12, 2016 to proceed with the drafting of bylaw number 1655 with the provision that no more than 50% of the dwellings located in area four consist of detached units. Therefore, staff will be recommending that the bylaw be amended at third reading, such that provisions be added stating that no more than 50% of the dwelling units proposed for Area 4 consist of detached units to bring it in compliance with Council's resolution of September 12, 2016. Thank you. Thank you. With that, I will open the public hearing and ask for comments from the public. Oh, don't jump up all at once. Microphone's on, it's waiting. Anyone from the public wishing to make comment? It's gonna be a quick meeting. Mm -hmm. If there are no other comments or comments to be made, we will conclude. I hereby close the public hearing. Adjournment. From here, second? second. All those in favor? Opposed? Motion carried. Thank you, folks. We'll be resuming in our council meeting at 7 p.m.